Hello! Welcome back to another video. It's me, Bangle. And today we are going to be doing another Sporkle quiz. Can you name all the players who have at least 5,000 yards receiving for one team? Answer, absolutely not. Because uh, if you guys didn't know, that sounds pretty difficult, actually, as I'm going to move my computer in front of here. Um, so we have 183 to get. That's going to be 183... Well... It's going to be probably 175 or 180 different names in this list. Or different players, I should say. There will be overlap with the names, I'm sure. We have 15 minutes to do it. I think, honestly, this is going to be one of the most difficult quizzes I've attempted. I can't remember who sent this to me, but it was on Twitter. If you guys want to send me a quiz, Twitter is the best place. And make sure to include quiz in the title. It's way easier for me to find it in the, in the tweet. So say quiz at Bengal Designs with the link. Uh, links to everything in the description as are uh, links to this quiz and all of the quizzes that I will do in the future. But without further ado, this going to be a long one. Let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, this one is obviously Larry Fitzgerald with the Cardinals. And then 1979 to 1990, I, Rob Moore. Rob Moore is on there, as is Lenny Moore, as is Nat Moore and Herman Moore. Uh, I know David Boston's going to be on that list. Just kidding. He, he had 1,700 yards in a season. And didn't get 5,000 yards receiving for the Cardinals. He's got to be close. He might be at like 3,800 or something. Um, I'll tell you, Anquan Bolden likely will be on that list. He is. Who else? Like, a lot of these names are not recent. And I, I bet on some of these lists, there's going to be running back. We'll try OJ Anderson. We do get Anderson. Probably not that. Flipper Anderson for the Rams. And that is the only Anderson that we do end up getting. This going to be my toughest quiz, guys. I'm going to blank on names. There are just way too many to re remember and know and, and you know, recollect. It's going to be a super difficult quiz. We're just going to move on to the Packers. Donald Driver is going to be that top one. Don Hudson will be on this list. He'll be the 35 to 45. I said Houston. Hudson. There we go. Um, I'll tell you that Jordy Nelson will be on this list. I will say that Sterling Sharp will be, as is Shannon Sharp with the Broncos. Greg Jennings will be. He's 2006. He was on the Dolphins. I know he left for the Dolphins and then I think the Vikings, but in 2012? Yo, time flies. We have a present receiver. 2011 to present. Randall Cobb. Cobb. I wonder if there's an Adams in this. Is. I know it won't be Devontae. There's no Adams. Who is 2007 to 13 and then again in 15? He came back. So he would have been with Aaron Rodgers the entire time. I wonder if Jermichael Finley's on this list. That would have been cool. 2007 to 13, and then 15. I'm going to have no idea on that one. I'm going to have no idea. We'll come back to it, maybe. Broncos. Uh, 1995 to 2006 with the Broncos. Rod Smith. We get Jackie Smith and Jerry Smith for the Cardinals and Redskins, respectively. Probably some other Smiths. Steve Smith, I'm sure, will be on this list, as, a, as is Jimmy Smith. Broncos, 2010 to present, Demarius Thomas. Emmanuel Sanders might be on this list. He's not, but we had Frank Sanders and Ricky Sanders. 1995 to 2003. That could be Ed McCaffrey. It is Ed McCaffrey. 1985 to 95. Who was John Elway rocking out with for his career? I, I'm going to have no idea. I don't remember. Chiefs, 1997-2008. Dude, I feel so stupid that I don't know some of these. Tony Gonzalez, actually. It's got to be. There we go. Oh, tight ends. I totally forgot about them, kind of. Besides, you know, Tony Gonzalez just there. Uh, Dwayne Bowe will be on the list. 2001-2007. There's no way Larry Johnson's on this list, but I can guarantee you other Johnsons will be like Calvin and Andre. We do get Chad as well. There's Calvin Johnson. A couple Johnsons in there, but none for the Chiefs. Uh, I already know I'm going to blank on easy ones. It's just, it's the way that this works. I can't spend too much time thinking about it because I'm going to lose and it's not going to be good. We're going to go Art Monk. We're going to go Santana Moss, maybe? He is. Randy Moss, obviously, on there as well. Who else? 85 to 92. Would have been par uh, probably with... Uh, what, Mark Rippon? 
I don't know. We're going to come back to it, maybe. Um, 49ers, Jerry Rice, obviously. 96-03. Terrell Owens? It is. I wonder if um, Roger Craig's on this list. He's not. Dwight Clark will be, though, as we get Gary Clark. And then Dallas Clark with the uh, Indianapolis Colts will get to. We should get a few on that. Because I, I already know at least four others on that list, I think. So, at least three, we'll say. Hopefully four. 49ers, though, 2006 to 15. That might be Vernon Davis. It is. 85 to 95. Who else was on that, uh, that 49ers team? Besides Jerry Rice and Dwight Clark. I have no idea, actually. 87 to 97, too. I mean, it... Five thousand. I, I just don't know. Uh, Bengals, two, uh, 2011 to present is AJ Green. We also get Roy Green for the Cardinals. We're gonna get uh, TJ Hushmanzada on here. If I can spell it, is there a D there? I think there's a D. It is TJ Hushmanzada. Uh, who else would be here? 92. Chris Collinsworth might be on this list. So we got Collins somewhere. Where's Collins? Gary Collins for the Browns. How about Collins Worth? There he is with the Bengals. Let's move on to the Colts. Uh, Marvin Harrison, Reggie Wayne, Raymond Berry, uh, T.Y. Hilton, John Mackey, maybe? If it ain't Mackey, it ain't me. Shout out to Wiza. 86 to 92. I don't know. We're going to move on. Vikings, Chris Carter, and Anthony Carter. I wonder if Sydney Rice is on here. Oh, we already typed Rice. Stupid. Stupid me. Uh, 92 to... Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, man. What was his name? I'm blanking, but I just... I just uh, had Bernard Berry and pop my head. He's not on here? Would have been on there with the Bears, probably. But I guess not. Vikings. These are some significant yardage numbers. I do not know. That's great. We're going to move on to the Chargers. Uh, Lofton. James Lofton with the Packers. I meant, uh, I don't mean Lofton. Well, I'm glad I got him, but I mean uh, Lance Allworth. There we go. Also going to have Antonio Gates. We're also going to have maybe Keenan McCardell. We get McCardell. Maybe for the Jaguars? He isn't the Jaguars. Who else? We got Chris Chambers, maybe. Not with, where Chris Chambers? Dolphins? Uh, shoot. <laughs> I'm getting for other teams that I'm not intending. Who else would be another receiver like with Keenan McCardell? I thought he was on the Chargers at some point. Who else would have been there with the Chargers, dude? 2004 to 2015. That one should be easy. That's a receiver, and I can't think of his name. Well, I clearly a receiver. Um, Kellen Winslow is going to be on this list. What is the name of the Chargers receiver? That twenty or 2004 to 2015 is going to bother me. We're going to move on, though. We're going to Isaac Bruce with the Rams. We're going to go Torrey Holt with the Rams. We're going to go maybe Marshall Falk. He didn't have 5,000 receiving yards on the greatest show on turf. I'm going to miss the rest. Eagles. Um, Harold Carmichael. Tw uh, 2008 to 2013. Sean Jackson. V-Jax for the Chargers. I knew it wasn't him. Because he's under 5,000. He's very close, though. I don't know why I didn't guess him. I should have guessed him. I know it's wrong. But <laughs> 82 to 90. There's no way. There's no way. We're going to move on. Patriots. I can tell you I'm not getting 1977 to 1989. It's probably an obvious player. I'm not going to get it. Wes Welker, maybe? Yes. Gronk? Yes. I'm honestly shocked there aren't more. Uh, that might be Dion Branch. We get Dion. We're, we get a branch. Cliff Branch. Who would have been a receiver? Uh, Troy Smith? I don't know. Troy Brown? That's his name. Troy Brown. We also get Eddie Brown. Browns, speaking of next, we will have 64 to 77. Uh, what is your name? Paul Warfield. Boom. 46 to 50. There's just no way. 78 to 90. I'm going to pass. We're going to move on. Jason Witten with the Cowboys. We're going to have uh, Michael Irvin. Drew Pearson. I skipped one. Who did I skip? 
77 to 86. It was better than Drew Pearson, and I don't even have a clue as to who it might be. Cowboys 2010 to present, maybe Des Bryant. I'm getting a little bit of lag here. It is Des Bryant. And we're going to skip the rest. Oilers, Titans. Uh, oof. Oilers, Billy White Shoes. Well, we already have Johnson. <laughs> I have no idea. I don't know that I can name any of these players. Lions. 94 to 01. I'm going to try to get the top for each one. Maybe we'll come back to some of these. Dolphins, we got Mark Clayton and Mark Duper. Those are softballs. 93 to 2000. I'm not going to get that. Jets, Don Maynard is number one. I doubt Freeman and McNeil is here, but he's a running back. 2000 to 2008 for the Jets. Ugh, you're killing me. I don't know. 95 to 05 should be an easy one, dude. Who was good on the Jets then? Nobody, but I mean, who, who would have received with yardage? We're going to move on to the Steelers. Hines Ward. We're going to get Lynn Swan. We're going to get John Stallworth. Can't type with this computer. 2000, 2005, maybe Heath Evans. We had Lee Evans with the Bills. 2005 to 2015, Santonio Holmes. Really? Two thousand five to twenty. I wonder. Ugh, I have no idea. I have no idea who that is. And granted, a lot of this is I'm not thinking fast. I'm trying to go pretty fast, pretty quick. So you get Roddy White. Also get Sammy White with the Vikings. Uh, Julio Jones. We're gonna have Andre Risen for sure. We're moving on to the Bills. Andre Reed. We also get Jake Reed. Let's get a Williams crossed off. Have I already done that? What about Wilson? There we go. <laughs> White. Smith. Bills. 96 to 05. I hate when I blank on names, dude, but I'm, I'm blanking on names. Raiders. We get Tim Brown. I'm honestly, the years don't match up. I'm kind of surprised Joey Porter is not on there. Steve Largent's going to be on there with the Seahawks, though. Maybe Joey Galloway? Doug Baldwin will be, though. What about the Saints? Joe Horn. Marquise Colston. Who is 85 to 93? I don't know. Giants. Amani Toomer. It's probably running backs. It's probably Tiki Barber and Frank Gifford. It's both. Okay. Panthers. We only have three minutes. Uh, Moose and Muhammad. And Greg Olson. Boom. Ravens. Derek Mason. We also get him with the Titans. That was obvious. I should have gotten that one. I always blank on his name. Every single quiz that involves Derek Mason, I can't remember it. Thankfully, I have here. And then 01 to 2010. Todd Heap? Todd Heap. Buccaneers. 87 to 92. I have no idea. And then Texans 2013 to present is DeAndre Hopkins. And then Bears, 58 to 67, is I have no idea. You guys are probably going to do... You guys are going to get a lot of names that I haven't gotten. And this is a lot the product of me being stupid. I got over half, at least. I mean, 5,000 yards is not that much in the grand scheme of things. I got a lot of the top guys. Although, I'm annoyed I'm not going to get Oilers. I, I just... I, I don't know. I have no idea who the Oilers might be. I know Earl Campbell in the with the Oilers. That's it. And there's no way he had 5,000 receiving yards. I'm going to type it in. It's fine. Some of these are obvious. I know I know the name of the top Patriots guy. I, I will know the name of a lot of these guys. It's going to be frustrating. Because I, I know players from these eras, but, I mean, like, a lot of them are QBs and things like that. 2000 to 2000, or 2001 to 2007. Who are you? I'm getting legitimately a little bit mad here. Let's type in some just common names. We've done Wilson, Davis, um, William Smith. I've done Brown, Black, White. Colors are, are good. Maybe add an E on the end of green. What about a Lewis? What about a Marshall? 
Henry Marshall with the Chiefs. Boom. <laughs> what about a Miller? We got Miller. Let's do a control F, find out where Miller is. Anthony Miller on the Chargers. I wonder if he's the father of Anthony Miller on the Bears right now. He went to Memphis. Who knows? Not a very common name. Anthony Miller. Broncos, 79 to 87. Who are some of you? I wonder if Floyd Little's on here. A lot of running backs don't have 5,000 yards receiving. That's for damn sure. Curtis Martin? We get Martin. Who do we get Martin with? Eric Martin on the Saints. That one was pretty easy, actually. I should have gotten that one. What about um, Thomas? What about... What about Manning? Eli Manning, maybe, Johnny. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty much tapping out here. Eric Decker, maybe. The Broncos. Kind of surprised he's not on there. Um, and that is... We got 57. Average score is 36. Pat Tilly wouldn't have gotten. Mel Gray, no. Billy Joe Conrad, no. Sonny Randall, no. Boyd Dowler, no. Antonio Freeman, uh, I should have gotten for sure. Made an incredible catch on, I believe, Monday Night Football off his foot. Max Begee, no. Billy Houghton, no. Carol Dale, no. Lionel Taylor, Steve Watson, Riley Odoms, Haven Moses, no. Otis Taylor. I should have tried Taylor. I forgot about him. I probably wouldn't have got it. Eddie Kennison. Eddie Kennison. Good return man, I believe, too. Eddie Kennison, I should have gotten. I blank on him a lot when I do these. Charlie Taylor, I should have gotten. Bobby Mitchell. Um, probably not. Hugh Taylor on here again, I believe, unless it's a different Taylor. It is. A lot of Taylors here. Uh, John Taylor. John Taylor. Oh, no. That one I should have gotten for sure. Carl Pickens, maybe, with the Bengals, I know. Isaac Curtis, I wouldn't have gotten. Darnay Scott, I wouldn't have gotten. Jimmy Orr, Bill Brooks, probably not. Steve Jordan, Ahmad Rashad. That is frustrating. He was picked, what, number four in the draft? Let's Google here, Ahmad Rashad. Where were you? Yep, round one, pick four, 1972. Well, I know that about him. Can't remember to write his name. Chargers, wow, that's frustrating. Charlie Joyner is an obvious one. Malcolm Floyd. Ah. Oh! <laughs> Henry Ellard and Elroy Hirsch, I could have gotten. With the Eagles, uh, I'm not really mad about any of those. Mike Quick, I probably could have gotten because uh, he is the father of Brian Quick. Fun fact. Stanley Morgan with the Patriots. No. Irving Fryer, I should have gotten, though. That one that one I should have gotten for sure. Ozzie Newsome, you idiot me. Oh, tight end. Oh, wow. Ravens GM. I'm stupid. Bullet Bob Hayes, I should have gotten for sure. 100%. If I thought about it more, I would have gotten Ernest Givens. Yo. And Haywood Jeffries. I should have gotten Haywood Jeffries and Ernest Givens. You can't remember all of them. Brett Perriman, father of Bernard. Not Bernard. Uh, uh, Rashad Perriman. Should have gotten him. Wayne Corbett, I should have gotten. Al Toon and Lavernius Coles. I should have gotten all of those. Great. Steelers, I'm not mad about that. Falcons, no. Eric Moulds. Fred Boletnikoff, easy. Softballs, Brian Blades, I don't know who that is. Mark Carrier, the Bucks, interesting. And then Johnny Morris is the only 5,000-yard receiver in Bears history. Uh, this was a really, really tough quiz, in my opinion. Let me know if you guys did any better. I think it would be difficult to do better, honestly, with some of these names. I think you could do better if you got all the names that I got. Plus, the softballs that I missed, you could have done it. But this was a tough quiz for me. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy.